has a taste. She was not capping. <gasps> oh it's spicy. My gosh. Oh. <laughs> You over there smacking the rice. This is good. What's, What's up, up, guys? Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to the, the channel. channel. It's your boy, Seb. Carlisa. As y'all see by the title today, you already know what we're getting into. And also, you guys can see it's pitch dark out today. This is going to be yes. a little late night vibe, you know, eat with us type video today. Yes, it's a late night vibe, y'all. So we found a Haitian restaurant that was still open and but they actually were out of a couple things that we wanted to try. So, so, bummed, yeah. so some of the things that they were out of like the patties and a couple other things that they didn't have. It was just because I guess they were so good that they get she said they, they sold, get sold out, out and, like, they, and they buy and buy and they, bundles. Yeah, like they literally call and like get sold out so fast. So guys, we might have to do a part three with some of the other options that you guys had uh, listed below on our other video. So if you guys have any other suggestions or anything for um, more Haitian cuisine, definitely make sure you comment down below and we may do a part three because we would like to try those items as well. But also what we were going to get that you guys mentioned in the comments, we don't forget about you guys. Remember, yes. like, we really try to get everything that we you guys mentioned in the comments. So mm -hmm. they had no patties, which we were going to try the fish patty and, the chicken. and the chicken. And what else that they didn't have? The black rice. The it's black only on Saturdays rice. and Sundays. Yes. But this food looks really good and they actually made everything 100% fresh for us. Yes. So. Yeah. But hey, scratch everything else. We excited that we got this food. You guys are ready for this part two. We're here dropping this now. Yes. Late night edition. But let's get into this video because this food looks amazing, guys. I can't wait like to show you guys. Let's go. We're going to show you everything literally at once because we are starving. I really forgot what Haitian food tastes like. It's been four months. Yeah, I we think. haven't tasted it. It's been a long many. time. All right, so what I got first, I got the beef kibi. So you guys see it. This looks amazing. Yeah. And again, she said, I don't know. I try to tell her because we don't got guys. We really try not to eat beef. But I try to say, can you put the chicken inside the kibis? They said it was like, you that's can't not do what they that. do. It's already she already had it made. It just had to fry it. But that was that. This kibi looks very good, guys. Very good. So the kibi is going. It's called kibi or kibbit. It says this is the Google definition: traditional Arabic dish that was adopted by Haitians. They are served in parties as appetizers and usually very spicy, while filled with ground beef. Mostly beef or lamb. We forgot every taste that Haitian brings. Yes. So this is the okra. I think last time we smashed it. You no, know we did. I think we, I think we did. And all you guys kept commenting, I love okra. Something about like, you know, I used to eat okra. I love okra, so and so, <laughs> etc. So we got okra again. So this is for everyone that doesn't know what it is. So the Haitian okra or malanga fritters is an appetizer common through our, throughout Haiti. The recipe varies from city to city, but at the core of the recipe is root called malanga. Malanga is considered malanga. the most hypoallergenic food in the world and packs a lot of calories. In Haiti, in Haiti cod or herring is added. Cod or herring is added to the recipe for a little protein. But all right, man, this is what they waiting for. They're showing the main dish. Yes. What's going on? All right, so guys. Um, we last time I think we had the pulley chicken mm -hmm. or we think we had like stew chicken. Mm -hmm. So this time I and mean, we specifically asked, you know, is everything just like strictly Haiti. Like we didn't want no Jamaican nothing. So this is what she said. So this is going to be the jerk chicken. Hold on y'all. Let me get this. All right. Y'all y'all see it? Okay. This is the Haitian jerk chicken. Yes. She says it's specifically made with all Haitian spices and sauces. And she says it's also very, very, very spicy. Mm. That's what she said. And also right here, so we do have like the tostones, the type of plantains that had to cook them. And you guys also um, did comment picklies. This is our little picklies. Yes, yeah, right so we here. have picklies right here. We actually got two sides to taste it. And then they also have uh, a different type of rice. This is the rice and beans. And it's going to be the red beans this time. Last time we had white rice with black beans. And then these are going to be their version of the fried plantains. Um, fried plantains. And then these two, this is the jerk sauce, and I'm not. I forgot what the asked I forgot what that sauce was. What is this sauce if right here? You guys here? can tell us what the sauce it's just, is. It's just a red sauce. 
Yeah. Wait, so what is I that song? But yeah, we did enough talking. No, hold on, guys. Oh yeah, you we forgot did. about the drink. So, um, I wanted to get like the natural juices, like the other one, the other place made, but this is, didn't have those ones here. So this one, she said that this is. These are both from Haiti. It's Cor Coron Fruit Champagne Tropical Flavor. That sounds amazing. So this is one of them. And this one that we have is the watermelon soda. Watermelon soda. She said these are the two very popular drinks there. Yeah, so if you guys ever had these or if you guys like these, comment down below. What would you, what you want to start go? with first? Uh, this. Okay. No, we probably should get the fried food first because okay, I don't yeah, like when yeah, fried okay. food gets cold. All right, let's try this Kibby. <gasps> Kibby, Kibbish, Kibbly with <laughs> beef. All right. Ooh, guys. This reminds me still again of like an Alcapulla for real. Let's go. <gasps> or also that, um... Brazilian thing. Mm. That Brazilian ball, ball thing. Mm -hmm. Guys. That's what it reminds me of, don't it? Don't lie. Guys, I forgot what it was called. Bro. Mm. This is absolutely amazing. I swear if she could have put chicken in this thing. No, it's all ground beef fried. Guys, if she could have put chicken in there. No, this is all. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it is a little spicy too. It's spicy. It is spicy. I gotta get a drink now. <laughs> but. I gotta get a drink now. Guys, it's spicy. It's a lot of bread breading on there. I There's no bread breading, breading, it's just beef. That's yes, not beef, that's yes, beef too? Yeah. The I swear that's breading. Beef. No, it's beef. Right there. That's not breading, dude. That's beef. Are you sure? Yes. Whatever it is. I cook. That's beef. Everything is fantastic. It's just very, very spicy. Like if it gets if the spice gets in your throat. Yeah, this is all beef. You definitely gonna do a little coughing and stuff. Mmm. It it's can't beef, be all beef. It's beef stuffed with beef. So what is the outside? Beef. It's fried beef. That's crazy. Look guys, it's and this fried is beef. Good, y'all. With beef inside. God, I'm sorry, this is I don't really good. like it. I'm not really caring for it. Well, you put them in here because I'll, I'll eat them for myself. This is good. Guys. I'm not saying it's not nasty. I just, I've never really been like a ground beef type of person. I haven't tried kiwi yet. That's why we got no, in the first place. Yes. But guys, the kiwi is amazing. It's good. I'm not locking it, but I think I need like a. A crema sauce or something to dip in it. She, it definitely is. Looks like it's just all beef uh, curled up and fried all together, and the flavors are very textury. Textury is very spicy. Yeah, it's spicy. But everything that flows too. Like everything. Like, guys, just take one more look at that. It's just like a fried beefy ball. I don't know how to explain <laughs> it, but it's just good, guys. This is good. No, it's good. It's definitely spicy. Um, spicy, very seasoned, flavorful. And it just tastes like a ground, like a ground beef, a fried ground beef ball, mm -hmm. like a fried meatball with more beef inside of it, but spicy no, more and spicy Haitian too. version. Yes. Okay, so this is the okra, the malanga, mm -hmm. malanga fritters. Mm -hmm. The other place that we tried was definitely different. Did not They're look different. like this at all. They're like different shaped and all. It looked like a fry, honestly. Okra, I believe. These ones though. It doesn't really smell like it doesn't really smell like anything. Okay, guys. So this mm. looks totally different than the other place that we had. So yeah. So this one looks like this. The other one had like a lot more green stuff in there. Remember? Mm -hmm. It was like green stuff, and it was like a darker. Uh, Just the way they cooked it looked like they added more things. Into it was it. like more um, darker. Guys. And the texture was more chewier. The texture was. I don't know what you dipped this in. But mm. to me, you don't need anything. This is good by itself. It's very soft in the middle and it's very crunchy. It has that crunchy taste for the, from the outside when it's fried. This, this dipping, is spicy too. This dip with ketchup or... Let's see what this is. I mix this with my rice. I mix this with my mashed potatoes. Guys, this is good too. I forgot no, this one is, This one is good. No, it tastes different though. Don't lie. It tastes different than the other place. Everyone cooks food different. But it's been for my I don't know how the other aqua taste. What is this? Taste it. This is that red sauce? I don't know what this is. 
Mm. What is that? It's hmm. like spaghetti sauce. Yeah, it's like a tomato sauce. The tomato is spaghetti sauce. It's good. No, it's good. Mm. Now this one is good. Well, how do you explain the flavor for this though? The aqua I flavor. I don't know. Flavor. The aqua flavor for I think it's like it's like a fried mashed potato. No. That's a fried spicy mashed potato. The texture is of a mashed potato, but it doesn't taste like mashed potato. Let's see one more time. How does it taste like? Guys, like I don't the taste know. is you guys bland. Have to taste it. The taste is like bland, like there's no taste to it, but they say sometimes they put the their like codfish in here. It tastes like yeah, like like fish and a little bit of what I just said. It's I like don't a, know, guys. Like a French fry. The crisp is a French fry. The inside is like mashed potato texture. And I don't know what it is. It, it tastes like fish a little bit too. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but this is good, y'all. I like it, but I just need a dinner sauce. These these are good. Yeah. Mm. All right, let me get a drink now, guys. Which one are we gonna open first? I'm opening this champagne. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can smell it as soon as you. This open smells it. like uh uh choppy cola. What's that? That's what it smells like. Choppy Look. cola. Mm -hmm. I know that's good. And bro, I still feel the spices in my throat and right on my tongue. This tastes like a kiwi. champagne cola. You know what I'm talking about. Is that what it is? Yeah, it is. Well, it's, it's just their version. Does it say made in Like Haiti? now my nose is running from the kiwis. Oh my God. No, it's not that spicy. <laughs> like, yo. Damn, how does it taste? Yeah, this is good. I'm watching all that spice though. It tastes like a tropical cola. It tastes really good, actually. I give it a 10. It tastes really good. Whoa, there's major sugar in here. Yeah, probably That's is. That's the first thing you taste. Yeah. Guys, this is this is absolutely good. It tastes like a a tropical fruit drink. Fruit yeah, champagne. it tastes like choppy cola or like a champagne cola because I think that's basically what it is, but just like a Haitian version. Definitely, I would like that a lot. All right, let's get on to the main thing. Please. So I guess you're going to eat it like this. Guys, uh. let me... Let Look. me just tell y'all, man. I like every, and I'm, we're really hungry again today. Ugh. Obviously, like we yeah. always are. Guys, Haitian food is really busted. No, Haitian food is really good. Like, it's, it be I'm busted. so upset. I'm so upset because we didn't have the patties. Like, I'm so upset. How's it taste? She was not. Gap! <gasps> it's oh spicy. My gosh! Oh. <laughs> Guys, she was not capping. She said it's very, very spicy. She was not capping. It's very it's, spicy. It doesn't even smell like jerk chicken, though. It smells, I mean, like the jerk chicken that we're used to. I need some, like, barbecue sauce. Mmm. But, guys, it's juicy. It's tender. Take a look at up close how that thing looks. Guys, look at that. Right off the bone. Mm. Yeah, no, it is good. And, like I said before, like we said before, a lot of cultures use the drumstick chicken. They do. Rather than the chicken breast. They do. And that's something that I never really cooked with for real. Mm. I mean, I cook it, but. Guys, yeah. my mouth is absolutely burning with spice, but it's so good. So I got to keep eating it. That's how it makes me feel. I feel like it's really, it's really good. The, the flavors are so different. Oh my God. The flavors, I wouldn't. I just. I'm not used to this type of version of jerk chicken. I would say that. Um, I'm used to more of like a saucy, um, kind of barbecue -y type type of jerk chicken. Same for me. It's but different it's for really me. But it's really good. But this is really absolutely good, guys. It's like it's spicy, savory. Um, Very spicy, spicy, savory. savory. Um, I don't know. I don't even know what kind of spices because I don't know Haitian spices. So I guess we're gonna have to look those up. It's just very, guys. I don't know how to explain. It's just very spicy. Like uh, that's the main kick in the flavor. Yeah. Like I, I need another I, I drink. I don't think it's like peppers though. I think it's like a seed or something. Mm hmm. But other than that, the ch the chicken was cooked very well. The flavor of the chicken is very good. The chicken's juicy. No bland flavors. You can taste every flavor yeah. on this chicken. But we don't know what the flavors are. <laughs> no. <laughs> like, yo, I know we're in a car. It feels like it's a thousand degrees in here now after eating that. Mm. Really? You want another piece? No, nah, bro. We don't say Try that, that soda. Oh, yeah. The water. You want to open the watermelon? Yeah. All right. Mm. Guys, as you can see, it's really good. And we demolished each piece of it. So. Oh, my gosh. That's some good chicken. I ate more than you did. You definitely did. Uh, 
All right, we're gonna try this watermelon thing now because my our mouths are spicing up. And she gave us some napkins too because she knew we were gonna need that. All right. How does that taste? Tastes just like watermelon. Really? I mean, I would hope so. All right, this is the jerk sauce though. Let me taste it. See, this is what I want on there. Mm. This is super good too, <gasps> y'all. Oh, did I just spill it? No. Guys, this is really good too. Mmm. Is it jerk sauce? That sauce is good. Well, we gotta dip our chicken in there. What are we doing? That's one thing. Though. Let me see. Just rip a little piece off. <gasps> Man, you rip it off. Wait, well, I'm gonna just dip it in there, y'all. Ew. Got the jerk sauce right here. Wait, save me some. I mean, don't dip it like that. That sauce is good. Gosh, guys. Guys, mm. we definitely late night vibe chilling. Wow, right this tastes exactly like watermelon. Oh my gosh. Guys, this shit is spicy, yo. <laughs> like, she no, was not I just, happy. I like want to take nose, my beanie off because I'm, my nose I'm is, hot headed right now. My nose is running. <laughs> like, my nose is running. I'm, I feel like my head is itching. <laughs> like, yo, this shit Bam. hot. Nah, it is hot. My tongue is like, my tongue is like, it's like hot. My whole tongue and my throat opening area. But like I'm saying, like hot. you ever just eat something where you just, it's so good you just had to keep eating it? Yeah. That's how it is right now with the chicken. We need to move on. Like, we, God, we still got rice in and our plantains. Yeah. And the pickles. This oh. is really, really good. This tastes exactly, if you love watermelon, you like watermelon, this tastes exactly like just straight watermelon, like mm. nothing else. All right, y'all, enough with that chicken, but let's try the plantains. <sighs> Woo! And then we're gonna try the pickles. <sighs> Wait, where's the other piece of chicken? Uh, that my mouth is just burning. We could have just put the fork. Cause I'd be a hard headed, I just wanted to keep eating it. All right. Mmm. I like it with the sauce a lot better. Mmm. Fried shrimp, plantains. This is what we eat in our culture too. Mm -hmm. The Re Puerto Rican, you know, all that. Yeah. Spanish. This is good as well too. Guys, I just can't stop. I, I, I can't stop thinking about that spice in my mouth right now. <laughs> I'm sorry, but it's just. It's Y'all, you open up. What's the window gonna do? It's not gonna take the spice away. It's gonna help me calm down and cool down. <laughs> Last plantains, like you know, like there'll be super big Cubans, plantains. Cubans have big. Yes, yeah, like big plantains, small plantains, and like husky plantains. These are skinny ones. Mmm. These are actually really, really good. Mmm. I can't even tell you the, the. Let me taste this rice. I hope we can taste the rice other than the spice, because that's the main thing that's going on in my mouth. Right yeah, now. it's really spicy. It's spice. She was not capping, guys. She said it more than one time. Too. Yeah, she said spicy, spicy, spicy. She said it's very spicy. <laughs> she said our jerk chicken is spicy. I said okay. Woo! All right, let's move on to this rice, y'all. No, let's do the pickles. You gonna do the pickles first? The pickles. The pickles. Mm -hmm. All right, let's try the pickles. So that's our little small portion that's of pickles. That's the pickles. Hickleys, mm. Hickleys. <laughs> um, but I I don't want to try that. So you I think I'm personally not a fan of it, but you have to try a little bit. You ready? A little piece. I you have to get a little bit of all the pieces. That's too much. That right there, right you there, right there. You have to get the carrot right too. Wait, that's, you that's have enough to get the for me. Sauce. All right. All right, go ahead. Guys, I'm not a fan at all. Look, the juice is nice and sweet. And sweet. It's sweet to me. That is spicy. But other than that, woo! That no, that is spicy because that's that little juice that I had on my left side right yet, here. Now I taste the spice. Ooh, oh. that's I think that's spicier than the chicken. Yo, that's spicy. Now, now, yeah, it's kicking in. I'm just, I don't know, I'm just not a fan of pickles. Oh, that's how you say it correctly. Pickles. No, you just don't like cabbage. And I don't I, like cabbage. I, I, at he all. Doesn't, he doesn't, it's like raw cabbage. Y'all, that's that side is really hot. I'm not gonna There's lie. too much this spicy shit spicy. going on in here. <laughs> This is too much but let's try this rice here. Give me that rice. Last thing on our main dish is this black that's not not black rice. We couldn't get the black rice. It's yeah. just the regular rice and beans. Let's try it. How's it taste? 
That is a taste. Now, mm. let me get that other plantain. That was good. I love plantains. Y'all should already know what it is, y'all. Mm. This is absolutely amazing. The rice is good? Yes. And look how much they give us. Mm. Like, you taste each grain of rice, guys. Beans are oh fantastic. My. And how the rice is seasoned, too, is just phenomenal. Mm. Oh, my gosh. That food. I'm sorry, guys. I love y'all food, man. She, her nose is like watering for real over there. <laughs> but guys, this rice is amazing. <laughs> yeah, she's re-dabbing her makeup and all, yo. <laughs> Hold on, guys. I have to have a little break because of my nose. You over there smacking the rice. It's just good. Mm, okay. And guys, I've seen the rice that they use, though. They use the basamati rice. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. See, but since this is hot still. My, I'm cool on the it's spice. It's like burning my tongue because my tongue is still spicy. Yeah, you must have had a lot of spice. It was from that pickles. That pickles is spicy. <sighs> How does it taste? Um... <laughs> From that soda. No, it's the That's kick up in the soda. God, yeah, we don't drink soda. Too much spicy shit's going on, <laughs> yo. So, yeah. So, this rice. Mm, I was saying. I don't know what type of flavor. Um, You can definitely. Um, I feel like the rice is just like a tad bit. Um, I mean, I think that's how it's supposed to taste though. Like, basmati rice is kind of like. You I don't can know actually what taste it is. Feel the grain, like the texture of the rice. Um, I'm used to cooking like long grain and medium rice to where it's like really fluffy, but this isn't like fluffy rice. Um, and the beans are really good. I don't know. I, I just I don't know their spices. No, I don't know I really their spices don't know either. For real. It's, just, it's just good, guys. It's just like um, I don't know. Let me try something mm -hmm. real quick. I don't know if y'all do this over there, but no, you know, I like to do. I be, do I be curious. So let me dip my jerk sauce, my rice in this jerk sauce. No. I remember, I think it might be like some type of ginger or cloves. Because I remember cloves before. So ginger or cloves, maybe cloves. I, th I taste some type of like cloves or something in this, right? I don't know, y'all. Yeah, I probably put y'all on the sun. It's good? Mmm. Now, baby. you're mm, capping. I'm not capping. A good little scoop of rice. Okay, let me scoop. Ooh, so I need more rice. That, that was a lot of jerks to sauce. Mm. Let me taste it. Mm. Mm. Tell me how that is. It's good, but I like it by itself. <laughs> it's good, but yes. So I was trying to dip something. I mean, I already dip stuff too, but not the rice. <laughs> Guys, I'm full, and we didn't even finish half of the food. I'm about to eat the rest of this on the way back home. I am too. But yeah, everything was really good. I'm just still disappointed, like he already said, about the food that wasn't available. But that's not our in our control. So we would definitely like to continue to explore a little bit more in the Haitian culture. Exactly how we're doing in the Indian culture. Definitely. So if there's any, like, sweets, any drinks, desserts, um... Appetizers, party food, whatever, whatever you can think of, like definitely make sure you comment down below so we can try to explore here. Haitian food is absolutely amazing. Yeah, my I, nose is still like, <laughs> oh. And guys, your spices are really up it's there. Spicy. They, they, they're really spicy, man. It's really like it's spicy. not, it's not nothing to mess around with. Uh. We hope this Haitian part two. <laughs> what? <sighs> are you gonna let me finish? Go ahead. We hope this Haitian part two video was absolutely <laughs> dope. I'm gonna just talk, y'all. We hope you guys really enjoyed this part two. First time trying Haitian food, late night edition. Um, I think this part though, it was definitely the spice for us that really got us. I don't yeah. remember this last time the food being no, that spicy. I don't remember anything being spicy like this. Like she was not capping. <laughs> no, she wasn't. We were just like, oh, okay. 
But hey, we love you guys. If you're still watching this video, we really appreciate you. If you haven't already, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't also subscribed to our channel and join the family, make sure you subscribe. And also don't forget to hit that notification bell to get notified of all the videos that we post because we have a lot more content coming for you guys. And we really appreciate y'all watching, staying tuned, and we'll see you guys in our next, next video. video.